Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, everyone. How are you? Welcome Hi, back. Peter. Hello. Good evening. Good. Thank you. Thank you so Hello. much for being here on time. Okay. So punctual. That's good. I really appreciate it. Hi, everybody. Hello. Hello, Emerson. How are you? I'm fine. Good. Very well. Very, Very well. well. Very well. That's good. That's good. How about the weekend? Fun, boring, tiring, relaxing. How was the weekend? What are you doing the weekend? Funny. It was it was fun. Yes. Very fun. What did what did you do, um, Saul? Uh, let's go with my family to no sé cómo dice cortar to cut uh, what cut what uh, cut uh, oh. and this moment my wife uh, doing tamales oh um, delicious this moment very oh. very delicious oh, all right that's good excellent that's a good that's a good meal out of corn excellent thank you for sharing um let's see let's see melvin how was your weekend melvin what did you do on the weekend melvin hi everyone um my weekend is very heavy because um i'm study actually um i every 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 friday i go to guatemala i study in guatemala and um every yes all sunday and every um every saturday sorry and every monday i go back my home and really Every yes. every every weekend, every weekend. Oh my goodness! So that's very tiring. So what time do yes. you go Friday? What time do you go to Guatemala on Friday after the class? Yes, yes. The last Friday, I go to the um, I I go to the meet. Uh, no, um, um, uh huh. I'm, I go to the uh, the bus um, and I listen the English class. All right. Oh, I remember that. Yeah. Yes. I remember nice. that I saw you in a bus, but I, I yes. was thinking that you were traveling to your house. No. Oh, you were going to Guatemala. Yes, yeah. I say. Actually, it's very noisy. Oh, okay. Where? In the capital? Like Guatemala, Guatemala? In the city? Mm, no. It's... Mm, it's más cerca. It's oh, more... Closer? It's closer? All right. Yeah, it's, uh... What What are you studying? If you don't mind me asking. I study um, trabajo social. No sé cómo se oh, dice. Social, social work. Yes, yeah, social work. All right. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, now let me ask you something, Melvin. I'm curious about that. I'm sorry. But why did you decide to go to Guatemala to study that? Because uh, I live in the Trifinio region and, and I. No sé cómo decir, tuve, eh, gané, I got it. I got, uh -huh. a scholarship. I, I got, yes, a scholarship. Awesome. All right. Hey, that's cool. I didn't know that much about you, that I know. Uh, very good, Melvin. So take advantage, aprovecha, take advantage of that scholarship. All right. Thank Congrats you. Congrats on that. Very good, Melvin. I thank you so much for sharing. All right. Good. Jose Haco, how was your weekend? 
Good, good evening. Uh, well, my weekend was very bored because I worked in my, my homework of the university and, uh, and I study English uh, too. All right. But and not very interesting. Okay, not nothing interesting to do, nothing. No. Just like studying okay. all day. Uh, no. Uh, ¿Cómo se dice solo la mitad del día? O solo half. una parte del día. Oh, okay, yeah. half of the day, half of it. Half of the day. Mm -hmm. Yep. Oh. I'm gonna write it. I'm gonna write it here. Half, half of the day. La mitad del día. Half of it. All right. Okay. Thank you, Jose. I really appreciate that. And uh, let's go. Okay. I have uh, a cup. Uh, I have some words right now here. All right. And uh, I'm going to show you the words. I need sentences with those words. All right. If you don't know the meaning, look for the meaning and then you tell me the sentence. All right. So let's go. Let's do it right now. Uh, oh, by the way, I'm sorry. Let me let me make this in Spanish. Eh, como cuatro o cinco de ustedes no pueden hacer la actividad del día de mañana. All right? Por las razones que ellos ya me expusieron a mí, que son válidas. All right? So, lo que yo estaba pensando, ¿ok? No sé si ustedes están de acuerdo, es moverla para el día de miércoles. All right. Y somos 30 y cuántos? 30. Este grupo es grande. Somos 34, 33. All right. En dado caso de por cualquier cosa que pase, que no terminemos el día miércoles, podemos continuar quizás la primera media hora del día jueves. All right. Eso nos tomaría el miércoles y el día jueves. Si ustedes gustan, si no, lo tenemos mañana. All right. Perfect. Okay, so it's going to be on on Wednesday. All right. La movemos para el pie para el jueves. Perdón, perdón, perdón. Para el miércoles. All right. Para el miércoles. Okay. Yes, Tony. Tony Castello. Hello. Sorry. I'm sorry. El, el, quizá, quizá por el clima que está como que quiere llover desde la, desde la clase anterior se está cortando. Mi señal. Es mi señal, all right? So I'm sorry about that. Uh, si, si, si yo me desconecto, usted se queda ahí, please, mientras esto cosa se reconecta, all right? So please stay here. Porque sus minutos no se van a ver afectados. Mientras usted no se salga, la sesión continúa. All right? Los que se van a ver afectados son los míos, pero los míos no cuentan. Así que it's okay. All right? Good. Um, all right. Yo tengo so, una pregunta. Yes. Eh, el tema lo tenemos que decir de memoria. Tenemos no, que no, leerlo. No. Tenemos que presentarlo. No. All right. That's a good question. No, me do not memorize, but do not read. I mean, it's half and half, all right? 50-50, Rafael, all right? So, because if you memorize it, it's going to be very uh, robotic. It's too hard. So, do not memorize it. for me. Just, <laughs> all right? <laughs> all right? But don't read it, I mean... Mm, the purpose of this activity is just for you to, but not do not read that much. All right. All right. You had it. You had it. Uh, no, but don't. You don't have to read it. I mean, it's half, 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 half and half. All right. Uh, remember that you are supposed to talk for two minutes and a half only. So that's not that difficult. All right, Jose, Hako. 
Una pregunta, Lee. Este, yo como soy nuevo en este grupo, ¿cómo es la, este, el procedimiento para la evaluación oral? O sea, ¿es así personalizada o, tiene que, o es así en clase, durante la clase? Es durante la clase. Sí, yep. es durante la clase. Ahora, a ver, hagamos un censo. ¿Cómo lo quieren hacer? ¿Lo quieren hacer en frente de todos o lo quieren hacer solo ustedes y yo? Opino que sería bien en frente de todos, porque It's si no a aprender y, y algo no lo decimos correcto, entre todos nos ayudamos. Yes, well. Al menos, mm -hmm. yo lo veo así. All right. Ok. Perfect. So, it's going to be here in the class. So, uh, you're going to have like two minutes to talk about the, the state here in front of the people. I will be taking notes. All right. I will be listening and I will be taking notes and I will give you your feedback to uh one day after like on thursday i will have the feedbacks ready for you and the final score the final grade all right perfect okay so let's continue with this so as i was saying como estaba diciendo all right uh as i was saying como decía I have some words right here, and I need sentences. Now, this is going to be a competition between ladies and gentlemen, all right? Let's see who is faster. I need fast, fast fingers, because I need I need uh, sentences in the chat, all right? So you need to type the sentence. For example, If I give you, let's do an example. Let's do a test. I'm going to give you a word, okay? I'm going to give you a word. The first person who answers this, who types a sentence, is going to win a point, all right? And the word, it's going to be hip. I need a sentence in the chat. Don't don't tell me the sentence. I need I need you write to type the sentence in the chat. So what's hey? Tell me a sentence. Don't tell me the meaning. Tell me a sentence. Write a sentence. All right. Nobody? Mm. Move your hips. Okay, let's see, Gabriela. Yes, Gabriela, my own bro broke her hip. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm looking for. I broke my hips to the music, <laughs> Catherine. Nice, Catherine, all right, exactly. This is the exercise, very good, very good. Okay, now let's do another thing. Let me show you the words, all right? All right, let's see. Ready? Let's go. Word, word number one is this. Oh. Let's see, ladies or gentlemen, who is the first win? Group. 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 We are going to learn a lot of vocabulary today, right now. So what is croup? What is croup? Uh-huh. Nobody. Let's see who is going to be the first to write the sentence, ladies or gentlemen? The ladies or the gentlemen? Me. Oh. I don't know this work. Okay, but you have to look for it. Look it up. Look it up on Google in a dictionary. So uh, what is crepes? What is I'm crew? I'm sorry, what is crew? It's a disease. It's an enfermedad. It's a sickness. Uh, laringitis. All right. So let's see. 
Let's see, I have one sentence here. Uh, Eleazar, can you read your sentence? Um, let's see. How many times do you croup your son? Mm -hmm. What is the meaning of croup, Eliasar? Es como, es una enfermedad como laringitis que se da más que todo en los niños. Okay. El croup. Okay, so let's see your sentence. How many times do you croup a your son? Uh -huh. We need to polish, pulir. We need to polish that sentence because I don't understand that sentence. Let's see. I don't have to work because I have croup. Okay, Susana, I am very sick. I have croup. Okay, it's much better. Let's see. I don't feel excellent. All right, good, good. Okay, the first one was Rafael. So one point to the boys. Let's go. Let's continue. Loud. Loud. I need a sentence with loud. A speaker. A speaker. How do you... Sophia? Very good. However, a speaker is misspelled. Mal escrito. How do you spell speaker? Sophia, how do you spell speaker? Uh huh. No, no, Rafael, no. How do you spell speaker? I don't remember. That speaker. All right, yeah, but it's good. Yeah, correct. A speaker, good. Sophia, so one point to the girls and one point to the boys. Sophia mm -hmm. and uh, and Rafael. I mean, yeah, the one, the one before it was Rafael. All right, let's continue with the other, the other word. Ready? Let's go. Grouch. I need a sentence with grouch. Sentence with grouch. Uh huh. <laughs> Sorry, teacher. ¿Cómo se dice omití? Omit. Omitted. Omit. Simple past. Okay. In my sentence, sorry, I omitted a little word and uh, made decoration next. Oh, all right. Let's see. Let's see. Let's but see. But I did first. Is it I first? first. All right, let's see. Uh, where is it? Oh, give me a second. Where is your sentence from? Oh, my, <laughs> am I grouch? Am I grouch? I'm not grouch at all. <laughs> okay, let's see. My grandfather is very grouchy. Oh, but grouchy is different. Grouchy is like the adjective. So, enojón, gruñón, but it's a different word. It's grouchy. So, let's see. But, oh, it's not? Oh, okay, okay. You're saved. You're saved. Yeah, that is correct. So, the first one was Rafael. One more time. So, boys one, girls two. Let's hurry up, girls. Next. No, we, we two, girls one. Yeah, boys two, girls one. Yeah. Soup. Let's go. Soup. I need a soup. <laughs> I <the> first. <laughs> Eliazar, you do you need a soup, Eliazar? Yeah, I don't yeah. found I don't found the soup. All right. Hey girls. Hey girls, that's good. All right. Three boys, one girl. Girls, you need to be faster. Más rápidas. You need to be faster. Ready? Let's go. Two can. Two can a beard. Yep. Can. Let's see. Let's see. I have another one here. 
I see a toucan in the zoo. Yep, that is correct. Oh, Gabriela. Oh, the toucan is beautiful. Yep. All right, all right, all right. All right, but mm -hmm. Rafael, I mean, Eliazar was faster. Okay. Oh. Okay, let's continue with one more. Sound. Okay, okay, let's see. Excellent, Susana. I love this sound. All right. Boys, four, I love freedom. <laughs> ladies, ladies, two. Okay, there we go. Let's go. I love freedom in the movie. All right. Oh, no, this is too difficult. Next. Pound. Pound. Let's go. Pound. But the spell is around Pound. Pound. Good, Tiamara. Let's go. Pound, pound. I need a... All right, Gabriela. Haco, excellent. I need a pound of chicken. Good. <laughs> All right. So the girls are recovering. Ahí vienen las girls. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. One more. Let's see this one. No, no, no. Pout. Oh. Pout. I need a sentence with pout. Oh, this is good. This is good. Let's see your creativity. Let's see your creativity with this. I don't like pout. What is pout, Rafael? Uh, Abadejo. Abadejo. <laughs> A what? Yeah, it's from, uh, from Google. Is a pocarse. Pouch Abanero. Abanero. Abadejo. Es como una mala cara. Puchero. Right? All right. So let's see. Like a pouch. So I don't like pouch. Uh -uh. Pouch. The pouch is broken. Eliasar, what is a pouch? <laughs> no, that is not good. Let's see, Diana. <laughs> My friend have my friend has a pout. Um, a pout. I don't. I don't. I don't know. That's not correct. Mary, my mother made a pout. Yes, that is correct. Thank you, Mary. My mother or my father or the baby made a pout. Yeah. But so, what is the significance of pout? Disgusting. Uh -huh. disgusting. Yeah, it's a face of disgusting. Like una cara de, de out, de, de wakala, right? I don't know. Like a pout. Oh, yeah. it's, a, it's like a bad face. Pout. Yeah, it's pout. like a bad face. Correct. Okay, who? Four and four. Four and four. We need to break the tie. Tie empate. You need to break the tie. Let's see one more. One, two, four three. Twice. The winner. The coupon. 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 Uh, the winner. Let's see the winner. The winner is going to be... <laughs> no, no. <laughs> yeah, I like. I like the coupon. coupon. No, but it's Maybe it's incorrect. One. Let's see. I'll I'll win a coupon. All right, all right. That's better. Yeah, Sophia. Because if I say, "Yo me gusta coupon," no, oh. no, Rafael, no. it's not good. It's not good. I'll win no, a coupon. Yeah. Yes, that's good. All right. Oh, cool. Very good, very good. So the winners are the ladies. All right, thank you, girls. You are the winners for this one. So let's continue. Let me, okay, very good. Let's stop right now for this one. Excellent. Uh, I buy my car with a coupon. Ooh, what a coupon you have, all right. I use the coupon, good, Saul. Catherine, I have a Burger King coupon, yeah. Excellent. Good job. Okay, so I have another question. The question for today is this. Okay, let's see. This is the question for today. Uh, Eric Callejas, are you there? Hello. Okay, Eric. I been on yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I need to call Tigo. 
because this is this is crazy. It's been crazy since like 2 p.m. Oh, okay. So, puede revisar la velocidad de su conexión, teacher. Eh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, most likely. Fast.com. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and check on that. It's been failing. It's unstable. All right. So let's continue. Let's see. I'm sorry, Eric. Go ahead. What is the question for today, Eric? How essential is a college, university, education? All right. So it's important or it isn't important. What do you think about college or university education? It is good. It is mandatory or it's optional. Should it be optional? What do you think? So you are going to discuss this in groups and you have to tell me your conclusion about the topic, all right? Remember the question. What do you think about university or college education? It's essential or it is not essential, all right? I'm gonna give you maybe seven minutes, all right? Let's go. Let me put the, the, the groups right now. There we go, please accept the invitations. Let's go, let's go, let's go. No Spanish, please. No Spanish, just English. Let's go. Teacher, I'm in two groups. Oh, okay. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, um, number, number two, two and six. And number six. Six. Okay. Let me move you to number two. There you go. William, are you okay? In the groups? Um... I think so, right? William in number one, number three, and number, oh, I don't find your name. I think it's good. All right, let's go, Elmer. Let's go to your group. What's your group, Elmer? Uh, I don't know what happened. Okay, don't worry. Let me move you to another to another group right now. You are going to group okay. no, to go to group number five. Let's go. Okay. All right. Teacher, Daniel. Yo tengo... Yes, Stephanie. Yo tengo dos dispositivos. Oh, what group are you in right now? Let's see. Let's el see. El cuatro. Number four and number. Six. And number six. Um, no, four. Four. Uh, let's see. Four and what? Eh, ahorita estoy en el cuatro. En este no me. I'm sorry. I'm back again. Sorry. Se me desconecto otra vez. I'm sorry. So, Stephanie, ¿en cuál estás tú, Stephanie? ¿Sagas tú me? Uh, ahorita en el cuatro. Ok, cuatro. Sí. Oh, ok. Ahí vamos. Ok, Stephanie, let's go. Sí, yes. Yo me, yo me uní y me sacó. Bueno, el internet de mí me está fallando, así que ahorita no tengo grupo. Okay, don't worry. Let me get you to another group right now. Okay, let's go to number six. No estás en ninguno, No, William? me salí en o dos. Pero no te ve, espérate. Okay, group number six and group number six. All right? Me too. Uh, I have a problem with my phone. <laughs> All right, no problem. Give me a second. Let's go to group number three. All right? Okay. Perfect, thank you. Another opinion? I think it's very important but for the this desarrollo, this, uh, this um, development of the development of my the on this country because the education of the person. Desarrollo personal. I think it's important for the development of each person. And where are you, Rene? What do you think? Yeah, I think is 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 depend the you object this in the life in your. Uh-huh. 
Opinion. Opinions about university education. What do you think about it? It's important or uh, whatever. It's not important. What do you think about it? Yes, and I uh, put in the in the text my opinion. Oh, okay. Let me check right now. Just a second. Oh, I don't see it here. Do you see? Can you see it? Can you see uh, Helen's opinion? No, no. Uh, but I think my my friend is the writing. Your friends is what? They are writing in the writing. Chat about the about the topic. Okay. So what do you think about it? Tell me right now, right here. So what do you think about uh, college or university studies? Are they essential? Should they be mandatory or should, should they not be mandatory? Optional for the future of people. What do you think about that? I think it's mandatory right now because in the work, I need the person of, I think, um, talking English or your study uh, licen licenciatura? Bachelor yeah. degree. <laughs> Bachelor degree, licenciatura. Okay. Yep. Okay. Bachelor degree. Okay. Or the Lower or economy anywhere. Okay. Good. Thank you, Helen. What do you think? Um, my opinion about the college education is that well, I, I think that the school education is essential uh, because it helps to develop um certain skills from when children are young and provides, um, how do you say, conocimiento? Knowledge. Uh, oh, knowledge, I'm sorry, I was muted. <laughs> but I mute, I'm sorry. Knowledge. Yeah, knowledge. Yep. But um, the university education is important, uh, but no essential. Um, because there are many ways to prepare and not all people have the same access to level of education. True. That is true. Education is expensive nowadays. Exactly. So you need it's to have money. Privilege. It's a privilege. Uh -huh. Good point. Thank you. All right. So share one more opinion. Let me go to another group right now, okay? Finished? Finished, coach. Perfect. Excellent. Let me check another group. Diego, you are going to be number one. Okay, so get ready. Preparaos. You are going yeah. to be number one. All right, to participate. Let's go. Let me check another group right now. See you in a moment. Did you finish? Uh, I understand. Yeah. And now you just work. What? And now you just work. Yes, yes. Ah. Okay. You you finished? Yes. Uh maybe, maybe. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> All right. Okay. So Jose Sandoval, you are going to be number two. Okay, so get ready. You are going to be number two. Uh, explaining your opinion in the group. I'm back. Sorry. I hate this internet right now. I hate it. I hate it. All right. All right. So, uh, let me check the other group right now. Okay. Give me. Okay. Give me just one second. All right. All right. You finish. Yes, I think. Perfect. Yes. All right. Excellent. 
So let's go to their room right now. Let's go to the main mm -hmm. station. All right. Okay, more people coming right now. Just give me one second. Okay, they are coming all together. Let's go. So number one, it's going to be Diego. Where are you, Diego? I don't see you, Diego. Diego, sorry, Diego. Sorry. Okay, excellent. Uh, so you are you are going to be number one. Then uh, the number two is going to be. Let's see. I forgot the name. Oh, Jose Sandoval. You are going to be number two. Diego, number one. Uh, Jose, number two. Let's see. I, I need a girl. I need a girl right now. So this is going to be for Norma. You are going to be number three. And number four, I need another girl. Let's see. Uh, um, another. Lisette Navar. All right. So I need four opinions about this topic. Number one. Uh, let's go. Well, uh, let me tell you, I think it's important to study at university because if you want to get a hand in in life, you have to study. Uh, it's key fundamental thing. I feel that my way of thinking, mm -hmm. uh, it is the right one. Nowadays, we are nothing if we don't prepare or study. It's very it's very, it is important uh, to have a stable life. Uh, for example, I am a study at the university in my country and I, uh, am, I am a striver, I am striving every day to achieve my goal and of, be, of being an English teacher. That's it. Do you want to be an English teacher? Yes. Perfect. I, I wish. <laughs> Excellent. I love that. Welcome to the to the English world. Uh, perfect. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's good. That's good. Thank you, Diego. I really appreciate it. Diego, where do you live? I live in, in El Salvador, San Vicente. San Vicente. Okay. Is it hot there? Well, can you repeat? Is, yeah. Is it hot? The zoo is, is yes, because here... <laughs> it's super hot there. All right. Yeah, super hot. hot. Very good. Okay. Teacher, future teacher. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's see. Number two. Who is number two? Me. Okay. All right, Jose. Sound of all. Let's go. Okay. okay. Uh, my group opinion is the university are important because you become a professional there. And if you maybe uh, pay more when you out because you have a a, um, a diploma. But most of the time, what matters is the experience. And in the, you are such a work and your boss, I, I, I have a experience, a paid experience, sorry. What do you say? Uh, experience. Experience. Yeah. Experience. O, experience. Oh, another word for experience, Jose, is expertise. expertise. So I have a lot of expertise on this matter, on this subject. Uh, I have a lot of expertise. Uh, so in the university is good because 
you are learn all, but it's not a full in a quedarse, no, I mean, quedarse with all university. Use study in university and practice your stuff. What you are studying. All right. Thank you, Jose. Good, good opinion. Let's continue with opinion number three. I don't remember it, number three. Oh, Norma, let's go, Norma. Um, I think it's necessary because when you have a job, and many times they ask you uh, about you study in university for continue growing in the company. Good, that's important. If you want to grow within the company, sometimes you need to study more. Good. And let's finish with the number four. Uh, I think it's Lisette. Let's go, Lisette. Hi, teacher. Hello. So, I think so the professional life is very important. And the study at the university is very important for your future because the university uh, open the door for the world life. That's correct. Uh, and the study at the university is very important and you need to study more if you you want a better job and the better life. All right. Good. Thank you very much. I I love when you are when you are like participating and speaking. However, there are some groups that were talking in Spanish, right? So están hablando español y cuando yo me metí, plum, hicieron el cambio del chip, right? Huh, you know who you are, right? So si lo pueden hacer, do it. Don't no esperen a que yo esté ahí para que hablen inglés, all right? Speak English as much as you can. Let's see. Let's continue. I'm going to send you a link right now. This is individual uh, work assignment. I'm going to give you, I'm going to give you a, um, a link right now. And I need you to complete this activity. Let me show you. This is vocabulary related to the weather. All right. So look at this. You have a map. All right. You have a map of United Kingdom and you have the you have the uh the words right here the drop down menu so you need to complete with these words the correct spaces according to the prices all right so let's do it but before that let's see what is your favorite weather Raul what is your favorite weather? Do you enjoy the rain, the sun, the cold weather? What's your favorite weather, Raul? Uh, the microphone. I can hear you. Sorry. All right. I love the the, the rain. And, you love and the, the rain. Weather. Why? The why do you why do you prefer the cold rain over the hot? Um. Because um, when it, when it's cold, you you can uh, you can uh, dry dry your your the temperature, yes. But oh. it, it cold is 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 most difficult difficult to to be fresh. That's correct. Uh, handle. And, and, uh, handle. Uh, handle. Uh, handle. 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 Manejar. It's drive, oh. but this is car. Is, okay. it's, it's for cars. When you say manejar otro tipo de, like emotions or temperature, it's handled. Uh, right. Okay, thanks. thanks. All right. Okay, that's that's understandable. Antonio Lopez, what's your favorite type of weather? Do you like the rain or what weather do you like? And I like summer. Okay, why? Why uh, do you like summer over winter? I like... I like summer because you can hey, go to the beach uh, and you can't do different things in 
in that place, uh, such as uh, swimming in the sea and walk in on the sea, and a different things I like swimming for the reasons. All right, excellent. Thank you, Antonio. Elmer, what do you prefer? Do you prefer winter? Do you prefer summer? What do you prefer? Win uh, I believe that winter is uh, nieve, verdad? or not? Well, it, yeah, it could be snow, but in our country, it doesn't <laughs> snow, so it, it only rains. But but here is only rain, right? Yeah. Yeah, I, I prefer winter rain because I, I feel very good. Why Why do you feel good? Um, I don't know. I can see movies, very oh, relaxed, or right. uh, other things. For example, I, I don't know, man. See documentals. Uh, está bien decir documental. Uh, documentaries? Documentaries. All you right. Know, only this. Yes, only yeah. this. Excellent. That's a good answer. Very good. Okay. Now, let's do that right now. Let's complete this activity, and then we are going to come back here to check the answers. All right? So I'm going to give you the, the, the exercise right now. Let's go. I'm going to give you five minutes. Let's do it. Abajito de ese ejercicio hay un botón que dice enseñar respuestas. Yo confío en que usted no le va a dar clic a eso. All right. I'm going to trust. I'm going to trust you. All right. Don't click on it. Pruebe where este. Is the, where right? is the link? Where is the link on, on the other side? Oh, I don't know. It's, it's in WhatsApp. Oh, I can send the link here. Don't worry. Let me send the link right now. All right. It's in here. Thank you. You're welcome. Let's go. Let's test yourself. Pruébense. A ver cuánto vocabulario sabemos. No, no le den click and show answers. Pruébense. How many, how many words you know? How much vocabulary you know? Let's go. Hello. Hello, hello. Um, y si no me puedo al país o cómo es que porque hay una parte que dice Irlanda, o sea, todo eso es Escocia o Irlanda. No, I'm going to show you right now. Okay. Look at the map right here. So let's see. This oh, that's a good question, Sofia. Thank you for that. Okay, let's see. This is Ireland. All right? This is Ireland. This is Scotland, all right? This is Wales, all right? And the rest is England, all right? Repeat, please. Sure, sure, definitely. This portion, this one is Ireland, North Ireland. This one is Scotland, Scotland. All right, this one, it's the skinny de aquí, this little corner is Wales, Wales, Gales, Wales. And the bigger part, this is England. All right. In the mountain, where is the mountain? Where are the mountains? What number, what number? Number two. Scotland. Number Scotland. two, this, co okay. Scottish mountains. Okay. All right. Yes, yes. Thank All right. Teacher, can you repeat the what is the the state? Sure, the Please. country. Okay, this is this is North Ireland. Okay. North Ireland. This section right here is Scotland. Scotland. 
All right. Mm -hmm. This one is Wales. This one is Wales. And the bigger portion, the bigger part, the largest part is England. Okay, thank you. All right. Ready? Mm. All right. Not yet. Okay. Is I finish, I confirm my my answer or wait? Just wait. Yeah. So 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 so. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Uh, finish. Excellent, Daniel. Happy thank you. Uh, All right. Thank you very much. No, no, no. It's okay. It's okay. Don't worry. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay. Let's see. One minute. One more minute to finish. One more minute to finish. Teacher, I finish. Okay. I'm sure. No, 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 it's okay. All right. Uh, we are now we are, we are now going to compare the answers here in the group. So that's okay. I don't teacher. Excellent. Perfect, Eliasar. Thank you very much. Teacher, continue with trouble um uh, the platform because we don't receive any mail. You do oh, okay. No, don't worry. Don't worry about the platform. Uh, just keep participating here. About the exam, we are going to find another way to do that. All right, but don't worry about that.
I'll let you know. Oh, by the way, thank you, uh, Rafael. Let's see, on Friday, on Friday, we are going to have the uh, first exam. All right, exam number one. All right. All and right. the trouble is in the what? site or with the time to uh, send us an email? What do you mean? Uh, a problem is uh, because uh, your platform fighter or is because the time to send us an email? The problem is that they have not sent you the emails. Yeah. So uh, they right. are, they have not sent you that. So we are going to forget about the platform right now. We are going to continue with our rhythm and I'll send you another link so we can do the test in a different thing, in a different way. All right? All right, right. Perfect. Thanks. Thank you. All right. Okay, everybody, let's go. Number one, what is the correct for number one? Temperature. 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 All right. Yeah. Okay. What about this one? Zero. 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 Okay. Zero. Let's see. Eliasar, please read the complete sentence number one. Temperature in Scotland will be around zero degrees. Perfect. Thank you, Eliasar. Let's continue. Number two. What is this? It's not snowing. 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 All right. Let's see. Yeah. Raul, rate number two. In the Scottish mountains, it will be snowing. It'll be snowing. Okay. Let's see. Is that the, is that the correct answer? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Let's see. Number three. What do you think about number three, guys? Weather, 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 Good, Elmer. Thank you. All right. Let's continue with number four. What do you have in number four? Raining. 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 Two. Raining. 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 <clears throat> Just read them. Ah, okay, okay. Aquí decía dos grados, yo no sé por qué puse cuatro. I will be <laughs> okay. raining with temperatures around two degrees. Two degrees. All right. Let's continue with. No, yo puse, es que era dos. Aquí está, es dos grados. Yo All puse right. Cuatro. So, what's number two? I'm sorry, number five? Cloudy. 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 Okay. Cloudy. Cloudy. And? Sunny spells. 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 Sunny Please read number five. The east of England will be cloudy with a few sun spells occasionally. Okay. So, guys, do you know what is the meaning of sunny spells? It's como rayos de sol, no? Okay. Okay, I'm like sunny. All right. So, but. O como, como soleado. Como sol con nubes. It's a snowy sunshine. There's... Yeah, it's. So, sunny spells is like. Periodos de sol. 
right? So that's a sign spells, like sign spells occasionally. All right, good, good. Let's continue with number six. In hey, Northern Jesus, Ireland. Overcast. 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 It'll be? Yes. Overcast. Overcast. What is the significance of this word? Overcast. Warm. Okay. Dry. Dry, dry. Over uh, dry. That is nublado. Okay. So, what is the meaning of overcast? Yeah. Nublado. Nublado. Okay. Nublado. It's like nublado. That's a synonym for cloudy. It's okay. they are very similar. Overcast. Yeah, it's, because I, I I I use cloudy too. Yeah, I it's know. very. Yeah, it's very similar. Where's the very, difference? Where is the difference, teacher? Mm, the difference is that cloudy is like there are a lot of a lot of clouds, right? Cloudy and overcast. Maybe oh. there are not a lot of clouds, but there are sections of clouds uh in the sky when it's going to rain, for example. Okay. Right? Cloudy no necesariamente es cuando va a llover. Overcast sí. Overcast is nublado cuando va a llover. All right? When it's going to rain. And cloudy, not necessarily when it's going to rain. That's the main difference. All right, let's continue with number seven. People in the... South. 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 In the south of England, all right? We'll have a nice day with a lot of... Sunshine. 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 All right. However... It won't warm. 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 Perfect. It won't be warm. Warm. Won't warm. Be that warm. Warm. There. All right. Yeah, Temperatures. Is four. 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 All right. It'll be four degrees. Can you imagine that? Four degrees. What is the lowest? The lowest. What is the lowest temperature in El Salvador? Mm. Zero uh, degrees. No, in El Salvador. Four degrees. Four degrees. Four degrees. Zero Four. depending on the place. But in general, what's the general lowest temperature? 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. Maybe 16 sometimes, but it's not mm -hmm. that low. So imagine to have a four degree uh, 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 weather. In San Miguel, the temperature <laughs> is very hot. Hot, 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 hot. San Miguel, the lowest is like 30. <laughs> Zero degrees in San Miguel. Yeah. Uh, teacher, ¿cómo se dice abrazador? Ooh. Calorcito abrazador. Oh, that's a good word. I don't know, to be honest. I cannot lie to you. Abrazador. <laughs> we can look for that word. You know. Oh, fire. <laughs> uh, no, no, I don't think so. Let's see. If you can find that word, we're going to look for it right now. Just give me a couple of minutes. I will find it for you. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Right. Ya me dejaste estar ahí. Very good. Let's see. Sorry. We are going to watch a video right now. Uh, I need one answer. I'm gonna send the picture right now to WhatsApp. Let me let me find the picture. All right. Uh, um, just give me one second. All right. Okay. I need uh one answer for this one. What is the difference between these sentences? I have three sentences. Uh, let's see. I need sure. one person, right? Yeah. Solo tenía, eh, encontré this scalding para como calor fuerte. Can you, type, can you type it on the chat? Teacher. Yes. Una pregunta. Este, when you, when <laughs> you use heat and not hot. Oh, heat like... es, es caluroso. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Hot is caluroso. Heat is calor. Hot is adjective. Heat is noun. Oh, right? Okay. So 
no soporto el calor, no se puede decir, I cannot stand the hot. Uh -uh. I cannot stand the heat. All right? Digo, está caluroso. No digo, it's, it is heat. No, it is hot. All right? That's the difference. Hot okay. is an adjective. Heat is a noun. All right? Oh, uh, spalding. Teacher. Teacher. Okay, Abrazador, perfect. según Google, this hugger. Is this, what was that, Rafael? Can you tap it on the chat? Abrazador. All right. Oh, sorry, no. I run. Okay. Teacher, <laughs> in the chat box, I read. Okay, perfect. Oh, it's, uh, oh. It's no, 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 right. All right. All right. Good. You will say that. Hugger. Abrazador no, Rafael, is hugger. Hugger is abrazador de que yo te abrazo. <laughs> right. Yeah, that is different. It's a different context. <laughs> right? It's hugger. I'm a hugger. All right? So that's it's, different. But is I right? Uh, sol abrazador. Excursion song. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah, we have another. So we have several words. It's called yes. it's a new word to me. All right. Let's, it's freezing. It's, mm. it's, mucho frío. That, that's correct. Yeah. Yeah, it's freezing. All right. Let's continue. So I need to, I need to um send you a video right now. So you need to tell me, according to the video, what is the difference between these sentences? <laughs> uh, let's see. Um, <clears throat> Eric, please read the sentences. Read sentence number one, please. Go to the car. Okay, sentence number two. I'm, I am going to go to the car. All right, and sentence number three. I am going to the bar this evening. All right, so you are going to watch a video right now everybody and you have to tell me what is the difference between sentence number one sentence number two and sentence number three remember that this is simple future all right activities in the future ready let me share let me share the the uh, the link right now for you. All righty, just give me one second. Okay, I'm gonna send the link right here in the chat. Okay, the link is here, and let me send it to WhatsApp right now too. All right, so let's go. Please, I'm going to send you to the groups right now. In groups, watch the video and give me the answer. What is the difference between the sentences? All right. So let's do them right now. Let's go, everybody. We can use will. Let's go to the rooms. Let's go to the rooms. Let's go right now. Let's go to the rooms. Let's go to the rooms. Wait. Teacher. Yep. Again. The same <laughs> yes. <laughs> what are the groups? Tell me the numbers. In number three and number six. Okay, oh, number no. three and number six. There you go.
intentions for the future. I didn't decide these things in the moment of speaking. They are intentions, so I use going to. In the second example, I said to
right? Okay, so let's see. We have three sentences right here. They are apparently the same, but they are different, all right? So according to the video that you watched, what is the difference between will, going to, and present progressive for future? Rem remember that right now we are talking about future, okay? So what is the difference between one, two, and three? Any volunteer? Me. All right. I will go to the park. Is you talk with your friend, decide in the moment, go to the park. Okay, give me a moment, Jose. Give me just one moment. Okay, so this is a decision, decision. in the moment. Yes. Okay, anything else? It's a promise. From... Oh, okay. <clears throat> It's a promise. What else? It's a, a spontaneous yes. decision. A prediction. Oh, it's an, a spontaneous decision like this. It's, it's a, a decision, decision in the moment or in parentheses, a spontaneous decision. Yeah, it's the same. So what it's else? It's a prediction. Make a promise. Oh, I offer. Very good. Very good. Okay. So let's stop right here. When do I use wheel? I use wheel for three things. Number one, decisions in the moment or a spontaneous decisions. Decision. Number two, promise tests. And number three, prediction. All right. For example, the most common promise, I, <clears throat> I will love you forever. I will. All right. It's a promise. I will love you forever all right <laughs> another can you give me a, a prediction with will a prediction with will i promise i will pay you tomorrow <laughs> okay i promise i will pay you tomorrow okay but that's a promise but i need a prediction okay i will write tomorrow <laughs> okay i, I, I will write tomorrow I but no, no have any evidence. To okay, let's see. Let's see. Daisy, can you repeat one more time? I promise I will go to the gym tomorrow. Okay, I will go to the gym. That's a, a prediction. Maybe I will go, maybe I will not go. Okay, another prediction. It will rain. I don't know if it will rain or not. That's a prediction. All right. So very good. Good, good, good. So let's continue here. Remember, will is for a spontaneous decisions, promises, and prediction. Okay. What about number two? What about sentence number two? It's when I, I intention or prediction. Very immediate. Prediction with evidence. evidence. All right. Excellent. Very good. So, going to is for intentions, is for plans, and is for predictions based on evidence. evidence. All right. Can you give me? Can you give me a uh, a prediction based on evidence? Using I'm going. I'm to... going to. I'm going to buy the pants. Black the black pants. I'm going to buy the black pants. Is that a prediction or a plan? I am going to the beach next week. I'm going, I'm to, going the to the party. Mm. I'm going to visit my brother. Lo que están diciendo suena como planes. Those are not predictions. 
Okay. I'm going to work. Let's see, Mary. Give me a prediction. She's going to take a shower. She's going to take a shower. How do you know? Plan, Creo que es un plan. No, no sé. Okay, but how do you know that? Una decisión que sí va a suceder. Okay, pero cómo sabes que va a suceder? How do you know that she's going to take a shower? Porque me porque es, es obvio. Es, no, uh, nos bañamos todos los días. Está sucia, está sucia. Uh, no, not really. Uh, no, no, no. Yeah. <laughs> no. Maybe she going to the doctor because she's sick. Okay, that's a prediction. Very good, Lisa. I am sick. All right, I am sick. And the prediction is, oh, Lisette is going to go to the doctor. That's my prediction. Pasado en que? She feels bad. So I can predict that she is going to go to the doctor. Another, let me give you another. Uh, I'm, I'm, going to, uh, I'm going to the dentist. I'm going to, to work tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to work. Okay, I am going to the dentist. That's like I'm going to the dentist because my third heart, my third heart, my teeth, my teeth hurt. Okay, my but, yeah, it could be. Uh, I'm going to work tomorrow. Mm -mm. That is not a prediction. That's a plan because you have to work tomorrow, right? It's but going to be closed tomorrow. Oh, going to Douglas? Douglas? It's going to be cloudy tomorrow. Okay, it's going to be cloudy tomorrow. Based on what evidence? Maybe the forecast. Forecast. Maybe the 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 how the the how do you say the, what's the name of this person? Like, uh, oh, I forgot the name. Um, but maybe you saw on the, on the TV that it's going to be cloudy tomorrow. All right, that's a prediction. Or maybe you see uh, a a banana a banana on the floor. Se va a caer. Is that a prediction based on evidence? Yes. She is going to fall. All right. She's going to sleep on it. All right. So that's if you a, a, a prediction based on evidence. All right. So if you go to work uh, for a three days continuously, my grandmother you will be fired to your work. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's see one more time, Rafael. If you don't going to go work for a three days. You will be fired to work. Okay. That prediction. Can I use will or can I use going to? If you miss your job, si falta el trabajo, if you miss your job, you will get fired, despedido, or you are going to get fired. You, will you are going. Will. You are going. You are yeah. going. You are going. You are going. Not One wheel. example, the strong Italia, okay. we come, it will come a uh, hurricane. Hurricane? Hurricane? Hurricane. Okay, a hurricane, hurricane will come. No. That might be a prediction. Okay, for Nosotros. This. But for Miami, it's not a prediction. A, a hurricane is going to come. Okay, for them, it's not a prediction because they are suffering from a hurricane right now. Okay. But the so prediction is the 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 the, the um, storm Italia. Oh, storm! Italy? Storm. storm in Italy. No, in, in right now in Mexico, Italia, uh -huh. uh, storm Italia. Italia. Oh, Italia, oh, Italia is the name of the storm? No, Italia. Italia is the name of the storm. The oh. tropical storm, Italia. All right. All right. The tropical yeah. storm, Italia, uh, will become in hurricane. Okay. Will become or is going to become? It's going, it's going to become. It's going to become. It's going to become. Okay, because the, the, these people the have strong evidence that With the evidence. storm will become. I mean, it's, it's going to become. A maybe hard. can yes. I maybe can I say I 
my my grandmother did and i and i won't get to sí. work tomorrow okay that is that is another example tomorrow we are going to continue with this because así se por separado no se confunden pero cuando hay que usar los tres es very confusing all right so tomorrow we are going to continue with that okay guys and girls uh thank, thank you, you again for being here on time for making the time for uh, to be present here for your punctuality and everything so now it's time to rest enjoy your dinner and see you tomorrow at 6 p.m on the dot all right good see you guys good night good night practice the verbs Practice the verbs. I send the list of Teacher. verbs. The PDF. Is, is right. tomorrow. Teacher, the, the, the presentation is for Wednesday. For Wednesday, correct. Uh, yes. But the, the verbs for... In the, verb. oh, the verbs is for maybe in two weeks. Okay. okay. Oh. Yeah. okay. All you. right. Okay, Mary? Uh, what? Todos, los, todos los verbos que mandó no, son los que hay que estudiar. No. Yes. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, son bastante, así que <laughs> me dan, right? Okay. Is your all, all the verbs in all times? Yes. All the verbs in the PDF. So in simple past. <laughs> all right? All righty. All right. Okay. okay. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Sure. You're welcome. Bye. Take care. Take care.